Um, my name is Miles Hart. I'm a swim instructor, and I've been at the Y for like five months. Yeah, five months. I come to work, I get changed in the locker room usually. Then I have about 10 minutes to get my class set up, think about what I want to do with them for the day. Then when the kids show up, the hardest part is getting the kids in the water, especially if they're youth. They don't like getting in the cold cool, but once they're in, they're usually in. We do uh, place a few games first to get them used to the water warmed up. Then we're straight into our swimming. We work on kicking. Our, uh, usually with my younger kids, I work on a lot of freestyle, making sure they know like the movements. Then we do games to get them underwater. We do jumping into the pool whole bunch of stuff, good times. And um, when I leave, I try to talk to the parents usually, see if they like the class, like if they have any questions about their kids. That's, that's usually what a class looks like for me. When I think of my role models, I think of great coaches, people that have taught me things, teachers, and I'm trying to be like that for the kids I teach. I want to be a role model. I want to be somebody they look up to, be like, yeah, I want to be like Mr. Miles someday. I was in the gym one day and we were hooping and this guy had a medical emergency and he started having a seizure and just seeing all the how fast the YMCA responded, I was like really wow, they're on top of their stuff, they know what they're doing. And I was just like, they were able to help him, he was able to get to the ambulance just fine he was like just saying thank you to the Y and I was like wow, that's really inspiring. If you don't feel like you have a family, you could definitely make a family with all the swim instructors and lifeguards. We really are like a family. We're tight. We we just talk to each other. We can just just cool with each other. I guess that's that's my whole thing. My name is Miles Sark. I'm a swim instructor, and this is my why.